back to a new video my name is janet if you've never been here before hello welcome please consider subscribing i would really really appreciate it uh for today's video we are going to be testing two keto recipes two keto festive recipes because you know the holidays are coming and of course i want to still eat yummy um if you've seen my other videos you're probably like girl i saw you eat non-keto stuff but that's what i like to do when i go on trips and things like that but most of the time i'm always on keto plus um my boyfriend and i are on a challenge with i suppose and my girl jenny whoever cheats pays 150 dollars. so of course i'm gonna keep in mind when i cheat um we usually do it for like a month and then we have like a weekend where we're off and then we usually restart again um so you guys this is what we're gonna be doing the first recipe is gonna be a keto champurrado um by keto mexi queen on instagram i'll be sure to link um her instagram down below in the description box okay guys so if you guys don't know what champurrado is I googled it. It says champurrado is a creamy chocolate drink from Mexico with a distinctly earthy and rich flavor. Um, it's super delicious, um, but it is a really, really thick um, drink because they do use masa, which masa I think is flour. Um, they use it to thicken it. And of course, you can use flour on keto. So this recipe is specifically for my keto peeps. Also, the second recipe we're going to be testing out today is Low Carb Love's cornbread recipe which i'm extremely excited for both of them i love champurrado and i love cornbread so i'm really hoping they taste very similar to the real thing and that's what we're going to be testing today okay guys so like i said we're first starting off with a keto champurrado and i'm going to show you guys the ingredients right now chocolatey than it does champurrado so i'm hoping it tastes like champurrado um i'm a little bit worried because we did use um swerve kind of like a lot of it um so i'm just worried because when i eat like fake sugar like when i have like a lot of sugar-free candies they do tend to make my stomach hurt so i'm just a little bit worried on that but i will update you guys on the description box to see how it went hopefully not bad um so i'm super excited i'm gonna serve my boyfriend and i a cup and We'll give you guys our review on it okay my friends so i have my champurrado here my boyfriend was supposed to try it but it's actually really late and he's already sleeping but i'll make sure he tries it tomorrow because i need him to try it guys because he's super picky so i want you guys to see both sides honestly i'm more of a like i already know um keto remakes of regular food are not going to taste exactly the same so i feel like i'm more passing compared to him so let's try it i already served myself some right here i already let it thicken so we thicken with the xanthan 
I don't know how to say it, xanthan gum. Um, and I already kind of let it cool down because in the in the recipe, um, Keto Mexi Queen says that you have to kind of let it cool off so it can get thicker. So hopefully, it tastes like, I mean, it smells like hot chocolate. So hopefully it actually tastes like champurrado. So it's crazy because I honestly was a little bit skeptical because I saw the Hershey's. I was like, dude, I think it's just going to taste like a hot chocolate. But it actually does taste like champurrado. And champurrado is more thicker than this. So this is like a thinner consistency. I don't know if you were to add more xanthan. I don't know how to say it. Xanthan gum. If it will be like, if you add more, if it will get like a thicker consistency. So this one's more like a, like a thinner champurrado. But I definitely like it. In Champurado is already sweet, but I don't like my things too sweet. Um, so I would probably cut down on the swerve. But other than that, it's amazing. And I'm definitely going to keep doing this for the holidays. So, Okay, my friends. So it is the next day. My sleepy head is finally awake. And he is going to try the Champurado. Oh, I just can't see it. But. Um, it is the next day, of course. Um, it is did get a uh, way thicker than yesterday and yeah, yeah it kind of looks like a cream yeah it's like thick. like a, like a ah. pudding or something yeah okay. i have to rate it remember guys mm. he's the picky okay. one so off scent alone off the smell of this fire does it smell like champurrado to you yes it's crazy huh like the chocolate and the canela the uh mm. how do you say canela in english uh, cinnamon. Oh, the chocolate and the cinnamon. Like, I don't know. Is that what champurado is? Just chocolate and cinnamon? Imagine. That's what it is the whole time. We never knew. Okay, so what do you think? <laughs> do you like it or not? I'm, I'm torn in the middle. I'm, Why? Why? Okay. Is this a mic? Yeah, it's a mic. Testing, one, two, one, two. <laughs> nah, um, it's... Describe it for the people. It's very thick. Like champurado, champurado's thick, But babe. this is mad thick, like... Babe, champurado's thick. But not, not like this. I think it thickened um, from yesterday, like, like, way thickened. Yeah, like, you know what, uh, you know what it tastes like? Have you guys ever had those chocolate snack packs? They're like the little vasitos and it has like chocolate pudding. Where? If you were if you were to microwave that and drink it, this is that. I have no idea what you're talking about. No? <laughs> no. It's the little I mean I don't know how to I don't know how to describe it for you. As far as it being a replacement I give it a nine out of ten. I'm telling you, it tastes like a like a recently melted warm chocolate pudding, like that. You don't know what you're talking about. I'll, I'll put a photo. I'll put a photo for everyone who doesn't know what I'm talking about. I put a photo, a little snack pack, a little chocolate pudding. Yes, for me. But it gets, okay, a, good, final it gets a thumbs up. Final rating, though. Definitely thumbs up. Final rating. Out of what? Ten. Um, uh, let's do seven and a half. Okay. Eight. Can you just say it, nine? Out of it's 10? a beat. No, no, no. I never said nine. Yeah, you did. No, I did not say nine. Yes, you did. Play it back. What, what was my rating? I give it a nine out of ten. Okay. <clears throat> I give it a nine out of ten. Um, if I were to make it again, which I am, I'm gonna do less uh, sweetener because, like I said, I don't really like um, super sweet stuff, and this is pretty sweet. But hey, compared quick. to a chocolate, you know what's weird? When you breathe in, it's mad cold. Oh, it's weird. I think it's a fake sugar. It's Probably. Big sugar. It feels like you just brushed your teeth. Yeah. And yesterday, guys, when I drank mine, it did make my stomach kind of hurt a little bit. So I don't know if you guys want to substitute it with maybe erythritol. I used the stevia one, I think. No, 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 just kidding. I used Swerve, which is, I believe, a mixture of, I think, erythritol and something else. Uh, if you guys have another sugar replacement, go ahead and try that because this actually did make my stomach hurt. But or just I love it. drink a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, my friends, so we just finished rating the Keto Champurado. Now we're moving on to our second recipe, which is by Lo